This is a film about a remarkable man, my grandfather, Luigi Mario Donnarumma, known in the New World as Lou Donar. He grew up in Malta, a tiny island south of Sicily in the Mediterranean. He was born in Valletta on January 9, 1911. Nineteen years later, he immigrated to the New World, to Detroit, Michigan. This was during the Depression, but Lou managed to find work a wife, and happiness. He also started a family, a pizza business, and a whole lot of trouble. For over 95 years, he's gone through many changes in his life, and he's invented quite a few stories along the way. And now, I'd like to share them with you. Rico, the bully. He, everybody was cursed shit about him. Uh, this guy used to come in, in school. He was full of bugs, goodies. He was right in front of me, sitting on the bench, desk. We, we had single desks, you know. But I was right behind him, and I can see those damn bugs crawling all over him. And I knew them well they were coming here and there. So finally I told him, I says, hey, he says, when the hell are you going to take a bath? And killing that. He, he got offended, you know. I told him, yeah, 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 full of bugs. Look, they're calling all over you. And he took a swing at me. And I almost killed the son of a bitch. He was twice as big as I was. I was always small, you know, like this. And it was on the feast of San Gaetano. See, in Malta, kids can walk up to a bar. If they got the money, they ask for a drink, they got to get it. It's the law. See? So, on San Gaetano, I went out and I started drinking. And drinking and drinking and drinking and whatever. All of a sudden, here comes Rico. On the same sidewalk where I was, on the same side, everything. And I wouldn't move and he wouldn't move and we met face to face. And there we started. Never even said a word. Then we started fighting. There was a butcher shop. And they knew me there because he, he was coming over to protect me, you know. And uh, I says, no, I says, let me go with him. I says, now, if you see that I'm failing, you know, a little bit, then you can come and help me out a little bit. He didn't, he didn't need to come because I almost killed that son of a bitch. Grandma's teacher was from Canada, and I hated to see her mad. She was a big woman, huge woman, and she tells me, she said, every time, if I find out that you come over here and you don't come over my house, she says, I'll kill you. God did, with emphasis that I'll kill you. And uh, she, she was very nice. 